It is October 25th. We are just pulling in and there's a pleasant surprise. They're pulling the corn down. Bumped a pheasant. Pretty cool. Anyways, I'm gonna be doing a little bit of light to uh, moderate grunting every uh, 20 minutes or so. Just let out a few. I'm gonna uh, sneak around a bedding area. Um, gonna be between a bedding area and a food source. And uh, hopefully I can pique the curiosity on a buck or two. And uh, maybe just enough to entice them to at least show themselves. At least get some good footage. So uh, stay tuned. The stand is a little over six tenths of a mile. Let's take a quick second to uh, to talk about what's going on this year. Well, you know, the season started out slow. I saw a few does. I shot the button buck. Cameras were coming up dry. Um, the stand I'm hunting in this video, I had put a camera up a month prior um, to the season opening and I had zero pictures of deer on it. Uh, like I said, the, the property flooded so bad in the back that I think it kind of deterred all the deer from, from hanging around back there. Um, now that the water levels have been down for like three weeks, I think they're starting to finally just come back in there. I'm um, starting to see a lot more tracks back there. We're slowly getting deer on camera. Um, once again, we are not guaranteed to be able to hunt this property next year. This is a county program. I checked the memory card in that camera and I'm finally starting to see some more action. I saw a lot more tracks walking in. Tom saw some scrapes on a hunt this morning, um, walking up to his stand. He got a buck on camera, he has a few does on camera, I have a few does on camera, and I got a picture of this guy. Well this is the best buck we've seen all year. I'm judging he's probably a two and a half, maybe three and a half year old deer, which should make him an easy target. And having him in 530 in broad daylight, that's a good sign. I'm hoping he thinks he's the biggest, baddest deer in the woods, and he'll respond to a little rattling later on. And uh, if I see him with the bow in my hand, I think I'm going to have to say, target acquired. So things are finally starting to get a little bit more interesting. So let's get back to the hunt. Out pretty good for me. 
right, is it? It's it. We time where everything's just kind of a silhouette. I might do a little bit more. And um, wait for another five or ten. If I don't hear anything, I'm out. I can still see her. There come the coyotes. I can still see her. I'm gonna hit that grunt tube again and just just see her reaction. this area out. I'm going to be on here quite a bit in a couple weeks. Well, thanks for watching. Thanks for sticking with me. I'm glad to see things are finally starting to pick up a little bit. Um, I'm glad we got a buck to try to pursue, although it may not be the biggest buck. Um, he's still going to be a shooter in our books. So, uh, until next time.